Hi loves, today's review is going to be on Sally Hansen's new Miracle Gel and I picked it up in the shade 420 Tea Party and this is step one here. It also comes with a top coat that you're supposed to use with this and this is what it looks like here. It comes in a black bottle like that and it's the step two of this um, Miracle Gel combo and I got it from Walmart for $8.99 each. So I'm just going to read to you guys what it claims so it on says the, the site only here. true two-step gel manicure with no light needed over 45 shades that wow and it's only from Sally Hansen leading the revolution in gel technology and Sally Hansen's been really good with their nail game lately because they recently came out with their color foil nail polishes which I love the um, finish of it so good job Sally Hansen <laughs> so this one is claims two steps up to 14 days of color and shine easy removal and, and no Sally Hansen needed. also says the advanced color coat and top coat formula contain an oligomer and the top coat also contains a photo initiator. The photo initiator in the top coat formula re ridic ridic ridiculates <laughs> with the oligomer contained in the color coat, thus curing the formula without the need of an LED slash UV light. As the manicure cures over time, it becomes more durable due to the increased hardness of the film which is pretty awesome. So LED slash UV lamp curing is not necessary, only natural light. So that's pretty much it of this um, Sally Hansen Miracle Gel Duo, all the information there. Um, so if you guys want to see how I applied this nail polish on the Sally Hansen Miracle Gel, definitely keep on watching. And I'm also going to update you daily on how the nail polish did throughout the week. So if you guys want to see that, then so please This is tuned. the first coat here. Just want to show you guys how it applies. Pretty sure I'm going to need about two or three coats because it's quite sheer for the first coat. This is how it looks like here and this is what the brush looks like. The brush is actually, it, it glides on really nicely onto my nails. So Okay, so I'm putting really on my nice. second coat right now because the color is still quite sheer. And I'm starting to notice that after the putting on my second coat, I don't know, the first coat gets a little tacky or sticky and once you apply the second coat you kind of feel that tackiness or stickiness it's not a problem at all but I'm just noticing that now but yeah I'm just going to continue to paint my nails and then I'm probably going to add three coats because two coats is still quite sheer and it's not I'm on my yet. third coat right now and the third coat seems to be making it to full opacity which I like and still going on quite smooth and I still feel that tacky texture but it's still okay so it's quite opaque it's not streaky anymore so definitely need three so coats here's my with nails with three coats of the nail polish it is fully opaque right now and I'm just waiting for it to dry a little bit before I add the top coat on but um, it's very very shiny and smooth right now even without the top coat so I like that and I like the brush a lot because it was just very easy to hold. The top handle is not too skinny or not too fat, so it's very comfortable in my hands. And also the brush part is, as you guys can tell, it's a little bit chunky on the chunkier side of a nail polish brush. But I liked it because you can even just do like two swipes and you would cover your whole nail bed. So I like that. And the formula went on very smooth. It was just that sticky part once I applied my second coat. But it didn't bother me at all. It was just a little bit different and surprising. So that's all I have to say with this nail polish for now. I'm just going to let it dry and then add a so top So I waited coat. five minutes for the color to dry a little bit. And now I'm applying the top coat. And it goes on really nicely. It's kind of like a, a semi-liquidy top coat. And the brush is still pretty much the same as the color top coat, uh, the color nail polish, sorry. And yeah, it goes on really nicely and smoothly as well. So my manicure is completely done. I actually stuck my hands out in the sunlight for about five minutes. And I noticed after five minutes, I touched my nails and it was completely dry to the touch. But my nails didn't completely dry until about half an hour later. So I think that's pretty good considering I did three coats of the nail polish and one coat of the top coat. So I would consider this a very fast drying um, nail polish. But I really like my manicure. It's really opaque, really shiny and nice. And 
I just love the top coat like consistency of the top coat was really good and everything so we'll see how long this lasts on me for the next few days I'll take you guys along we'll see how well it does with chipping and everything and yeah it says it's supposed to last 14 days the color and shine so we'll see how well it goes and everything and I will definitely take you guys along but I really like um, the nail polish and the top coat and yeah it went on smoothly and really great so I'll take you guys along with me for the next few days and we'll I see how well it goes. Today is day two of wearing this nail polish and so far it's still looking really really good and nice. There's no chip or wear or anything so it's doing pretty good for day two so it looks exactly the same as day one and I shall check yeah, back Yeah so this is tomorrow. my update for day three on my nails as you guys can tell it still looks perfectly fine there's no chips or no nicks or anything so I'm really impressed so far and I'll see you guys tomorrow for Hi, my fourth so update. today is day four of wearing this nail polish on and so far it still looks really nice and great there's no significant chips or anything but the only thing I notice is just the slightest wear on the tips of my fingernails I don't know if the camera can catch it but it's just very very teeny but overall it still looks great and nice for day four so I'll check back with you guys tomorrow. hi guys so five. today is day five of wearing this nail polish and I am incredibly impressed with it there's no chips or anything yet and usually within day four to five I usually get chips on my nails but this one it's staying put and there's like no chips at all sorry that's my phone but just a little bit wear like I told you guys yesterday on the tips of my nails but other than that there's no significant chips or anything so I'm super impressed it still looks really great from the day I applied it so I'll check back with you guys so I'm here on to update day six. you on day six of these nails um, I have a little tiny chip there on my middle finger but I think it's because my husband and I were moving our dining chair packages yesterday and that's why it chipped but other than that it still looks really great so you guys can tell my nails are growing out now since it's day six but other than that middle chip there everything is still looking good it's no chips or anything but it's still a little bit wear on the tips like I mentioned before but yeah I'm super impressed I'm gonna wear this for I guess a few more days until I get sick of this color <laughs> and then we'll take it off but so far it's lasting really good like the gel formula I'm super amazed it's like crazy because usually for day three or day four my nails would chip already with regular nail polishes so super impressed so far so I'll see you guys tomorrow for our update Hi, seven. so it's my update day seven on wearing this nail polish here as you guys can tell my middle finger is still a little bit chipped and on the side here I don't know if the camera's gonna catch it but my polish is starting to kind of crack a little bit but overall the nail polish is still very shiny for day seven and it's still it doesn't look dull or anything because usually when nail polish is on your fingers for too long it gets kind of dull but this is very shiny and very um still looks really good like it looks like first day nail polish like the shininess of it so I'm probably gonna take it off today but overall it lasted a really long time so I'll talk to you guys on my so I hope you guys of this enjoyed video. how this Sally Hansen miracle gel applies on my nails and also wears throughout the whole um, week I filmed for an update for you guys but today is actually day eight I didn't have any time to remove my nails and it's pretty much the same update as day seven so I'm not gonna say much about today's update but I have time right now to remove it so I'm gonna remove it with my cotton pad here and I'm gonna use my Equate nail polish remover and this is the non acetone version and we're gonna see how well this removes So I'm gonna remove my thumb nail right here and it claims to remove easily so we'll see how well it removes so it's not yeah it's removing quite easily like like an actual like a nail polish or an actual um, regular nail polish so yes it does remove quite easily so my final Bye. thoughts on this new Sally Hansen miracle gel color coat and top coat is it's pretty amazing I definitely would recommend it to you guys usually um, people's nails tend to chip within the second day mine tend to chip within the third or fourth day but this really lasted a really long time it didn't chip for about a week on me so I thought that was great and the color is actually even though it's day 8 it actually stays very smooth very shiny like 
like I just applied my nail polish. So I'm guessing their 14 day color and shine guarantee would definitely um, match up to what they say. But I would recommend it to you guys even if you're going on like vacation and you don't have time to color your nails or anything. This would totally last throughout your vacation and I think it's a really great product especially because it's so easy to use and you don't need light or anything because of the little ingredients in here. So I thought that was pretty awesome. And the brush is just very easy to apply on your nails and it goes on very smoothly and it was just a very, it's, it was a joy to use this and it's pretty cool how the kind of gel effect lasted on my nails. I think it was pretty awesome. So that is pretty much my review on this product. If you guys have any questions or comments, definitely leave it down below. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I shall talk to you later. Bye!